Hey, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, go ahead and subscribe and click on that notification button. I post new videos every Friday. While we're at it, go ahead and follow me on Instagram. I'm a lot more active there. I'm guessing Instagram may be one of your favorite apps. That's why you're here. Let's get real. It is one of mine, so I'm always finding awesome apps to edit and amp up my feed and stories. Today, I'm going to be sharing some of my favorite apps that I use to recreate my photos and make them look like they're super vintage. That's the wave on Instagram right now. All the Instagram models are doing it. The really cool part is that you can recreate some of those photos. If you're not tired of discovering new editing apps, I will be posting the previous editing app video that I posted so that you guys can find some more apps. I promise I don't disappoint. Alright, let's get it. The very first one I'm going to show you is called Unfold. I love Unfold because it gives you the opportunity to create and just plan out your stories accordingly. Let's name this one Insta. It comes with free templates that all you need to do is literally just input your photo, input your text, and you're ready to go. But since this is a retro themed video, I will definitely recommend FF1. It comes with really cool like vintage templates. It looks like your picture was kind of taken with film. And all you need to do with that is just purchase it. It's an in-app purchase. It was under $2. Let me show you guys some of my favorites. I love the Polaroid. All you need to do is just add your photo. Another really cool one that I love is this one. This one has to be one of my favorites. Next one is Hooji. I know you guys have heard of this one. It's one of my favorites. Use this as a regular camera. Just take your photo. And you're going to head over to your left to check out what it looks like. So as you can tell here on the side, it lets you see the date the picture was taken. The effects are fairly the same. Sometimes you'll get a light leak, sometimes you won't. You cannot import any photos into the app to edit them. But other than that, you can capture some fire. Next one is called Lomograph. Let's say you took the best picture of the day. This app just gives you various uh, styles of filters um, and all you need to do is just keep pressing on the picture to see if you like the way the light looks. This is a really cool thing about it that it's super super customizable. My favorite filter is Melina. As you guys can see it's like it adds a filter but it's still kind of minimal. The colors are very saturated. Also Leto is really really cute. I love the light leaks on this one. And Date Stamp just adds the date so it's a cool option in case you just want the date and that's it another awesome app is called analog film so all you need to do is choose your photo you can add a filter if you'd like i personally never really added these filters it does give you options to you know um, use light leaks and it gives you the opportunity to change the opacity which is great because some photos may not need such a sharp light leak I personally, I don't know why I love this one. Now you're going to head over to the bottom right and hit on that section. And it gives you so many options. It gives you the option to add some grain to your photo. This is where it's at. Dust and scratches. This is what makes your photo and can take it up a notch for real. These look super cool and super real. Uh, the cool thing is that you could just lower the opacity just a tiny bit and it totally, totally looks like a vintage photo. One of my top favorite apps for sure. Next one is Polly. Literally all you do is take your photo and it gives you the option to add the different filters. You change the frame too. I like the vintage paper so we're going to stick with vintage. And you save this baby up. You can import photos. Next one is called Camcorder. As you guys can see, you guys can see the date over on the side. One thing I really like about this app is that you can zoom in and zoom out while filming. This is the only filter that is available in the app. So it's very, very low saturated and maybe to some people it's not their cup of tea. But one major reason why this app really stands out to me is for the zoom in and the zoom out. Last one! But it's my favorite. It's called Snow. You guys are going to love this. So it gives you the option to take a normal photo, a video, and some other music option, which I never use. And this is really cool. A boomerang. So you can edit your boomerang and then export and add it to your Instagram story. Looks super fly. All right, let's just go with the boomerang. So all you need to do is 
literally click on that little happy face gives you various filter options but I already have my favorite you can literally create your little boomerang in VHS form okay so that's what your boomerang is gonna look like you can import photos with this one my personal favorites um, obviously VHS this one's pretty dope too it just like shows you a film strip so dope a glitch you kind of get the glitch and this one is amazing one of my favorites as well so that was the end of the video let me know if you liked it by giving this video a thumbs up sharing with others and let me know in the comments below if there are any other apps that you're going crazy over i love filming these types of videos so definitely be expecting more i'm always just trying to discover the newest app and i promise your instagram is going to be popping i love you guys so much i'll see you guys on my next video bye